Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to another Top 10 here on the channel. This time we're checking out the Top 10 Easter eggs on Innsbruck. And again, the boys have banned me from looking at this and working out what Easter eggs they've put in. They want me to react to it as well as explain it all to you. Because I know Zwift so damn well, I'll know exactly what they're talking about. Especially Innsbruck. It's one of my most popular courses that I ride. I never ride it. Football pitches. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Mini five-a-side footy pitch there. Um, bit annoying if you kick the ball down that hill though, because it's just going to roll all the way down that road. No, no nets either. Jumpers for goalposts, I guess they're using uh, in Innsbruck. Pretty cool though. I wonder if they're there in real life. Does anybody know? Are they there in real life, or is it just, is it just a bit of scenery that Zwift decided to put in? Pretty cool that one. Nice one, boys. Number nine. Oh. Bikes on houses. What? Where? Oh, under the... Oh, yeah, look at that. A little a little stone under the window. Is there one in that triangle as well? Yeah, yeah, on the triangle as well, look. That was pretty cool. Co couple of bikes there. Oh, interesting. Good one, that one. Good spot, whoever got that one. Number eight. A road sign. An upside down bike. So, oh, a circle sign is an order. I learned that on my cycling proficiency test. And a circle sign is an order. A triangle sign is a, a warning. Did you know that? Because it's in the shape of a W. That's the way they taught us to learn it. So that means... There could be upside down bikes about, just just careful. There's going to be a lot of people crashing, mind you. There probably is on us if it's a sportive day, isn't it? What? Zwift Hotel! Hey, that's cool, isn't it? I wonder if that's, again, I wonder if that's an actual building in New, in Innsbruck that they just they just plonked a Z on top of and just went, you know what? We're having that. It looks pretty futuristic, though. Does it have any resemblance to any real life buildings? That's why that's why I always wonder when they put Easter eggs in. Like, is it a nod to something in real life? Is it an in joke? Or is it an in design that, that they're thinking about putting, you know, a brand they're making a brand new course and they want to see how these kind of buildings are, are accepted? Or is it just did it, does someone just say, Hey, hey, I know what'll be fun. Zwift Hotel. Hey Dave, can you make a Zwift Hotel? Yeah, I can. Sweet, go and do it. I wonder if they do that. Here we go, signs, a wheel sign. Again, an order look. Normally in Britain, that'd be a, um, a red circle with a blue a blue inner circle and then a, I think a red band or something. It's like a, it's a no entry after such and such a time, I think. But yeah, Vix decided that that is a wheel. I think that might be a real sign. Anybody know? Nah, it's a wheel in it. It's not, it's, it's gotta be a wheel, that. Also a question mark. An exclamation mark sign. <laughs> that, that that's warning you that literally anything could be happening around this next bend. So hey, we take no responsibility for what happens to you on this road. Do? Hmm. Come on, number five, impress me. Come on. Number five is the spewing waterfall face grass man. Is that like a a Viking god who who s s spews water over his disciples and brings them luck is it somebody's house is it a grand design is it just the way the mountains formed it just so happens to have formed perfectly shaped eyes nose and a, and a perfectly uh, rectangular mouth which also spews water out of it i don't know it looks like he's got two arms and he's holding something as well that's quite a cool one i've never seen that actually either number four is look at that swift stations that see that is the type of i like that is cool because someone's gone beyond just you know just going ah uh, let's throw a random waterfall face man in there they've gone I know I know it'd be cool you know Swift stations you know when they have this parties yeah I know that well we should put some of them in the game ah oh, that look cool yeah and I would never have spotted those so uh, big props to the producer for for getting those in number three The Zwift Clubhouse, that is where the uh, the action took place, I believe, at the Zwift Club, Clubhouse uh, in Innsbruck over the um, the World Championship. I wonder if they're going to have a clubhouse. Will it be a clubhouse in Yorkshire? 
Hey up, come to the Zwift Club Ars. Club C L U B Ars A R S. I wonder if they'll do that for, for Yorkshire. Be cool that. I like that little one. That's a little nod to the clubhouse. Loads of people will see that and go in there. I think you could go in, you know, and just experience a bit of Zwift while the World Championships was on if you were just a fan. Very cool indeed. Number two is the toothpick ski jump. It's a ski jump up there, look. No, I didn't think it was a toothpick. I didn't mean a toothpick. I meant one of those, what are those bones you get in a chicken? That you, you wait to dry. Your gran used to put it on windowsill until it dries and then you'd pull it. Wishbone. Is it like a chicken's collarbone or something? The wishbone. Weird that. But well, there you go, yeah, look at the top of there. You got the big steep ski jump. Again, is that something that's real in Innsbruck? Because I guess I guess Innsbruck is pretty famous for, for winter sports, but is that an actual legitimate real thing that they've picked out of Innsbruck and, and put into the game? Oh by the way, can we just have a look? Is he wearing socks or not? Black sock, oh no, black shoes and white sock combo. It's not a good look. Hmm. We need to have a word with Victor here. Number one, this is the this is the top Easter egg in Innsbruck. It is the UK telephone booth. That that's I mean, is that an Easter egg in real life? Because I've been to places abroad and I've seen red phone boxes and people have the picture taken outside of them. They don't in England. You'd be surprised if you ever saw a, a red phone box because normally they're uh, they're covered in graffiti and feces nowadays. So um, yeah, maybe that's why people get the pictures taken outside of them now. But that, yeah, that's a nice little nod to the UK here. Appreciate that, Zwift. So there you go. That's the uh, the top ten Easter eggs on Innsbruck. Have we missed anything? Have you spotted something so cool? that you don't want to keep it to yourself. If you spotted something that is going to make us smile, if you have, leave a comment below, let us know what it is, and we can go and find it on Innsbruck. As ever, hit that subscribe button if you've not done already. Hit that like button. Always hitting that like button if you've enjoyed a video. Don't, don't just skip off it. Go to, don't go to another video. Just, just hang fire. Hit that like button, then you can move on. And uh, obviously, you can check out any other video that we have on the channel. Thanks for watching.